What you're looking at here is Bode multi-function wireless speakers, and I am excited to showcase these. As always, how I unbox it here live, so you get my first impressions. I'll tell you everything that I know, how I feel. So all we gotta do is rip that tab, and you can tell right away that it opens up very nice. But we'll put that to the side. Everything's gonna be identical on one speaker, and here's the speaker itself. Nice soft rubber, like that is a rubber top right there. And then you do have a whoa, I have. What is this? It's not metal, but it's like a cloth type of feel. It feels really good. You can hear that it's not metal, so everything on this thing seems to be very quiet. Yeah, and it has rubber protection all over the top and bottom, so it's definitely gonna be able to handle those drops. All the IOs in the back, I think that's the back, so you don't have to see it. This is where the speaker is gonna be sounding. So now let's see what else comes in here. Double-sided jacks, so you can connect your phone, your computer, your laptop, right to the little speaker here. And then your micro USB charging cable. The user manual. So the reason why I have two of these is because I want to pair them for stereo left and right. So I'm gonna be able to make these double loud. I mean, we're gonna test one by itself because not everyone's gonna want two. But if you want two of them, you'll be able to set these side by side. I thought this was just a metal topping for the brand, but it's actually the subwoofer. You can feel the speaker press inside and even this one, but let's give it a first boot here. Power on. Bluetooth mode. Yes, the speakers are facing this way, so this is gonna be the back. We see the LED. That might be the pairing for the other device here. But we'll do that here in just a second. I'm gonna connect it to the iPhone today. I would do my Pixel phone here, but I'm using this as my display for the camera, so I don't have to keep looking up at the camera. I can look down here now. FM radio mode, aux in mode, Bluetooth mode. So we have Spode. It's kind of hard to say. I want to say S Bode, and we're gonna see the S400 clicking onto it. Device paired. So I'm only gonna pair just one. So I'm gonna to go to no copyright music, so I can play maybe a longer bit. Volume is all the way turned up, but not on this. This has its own volume control. So right now, just hearing that, it already sounds like it's stereo mode. I can hear the left and right. Facing away. Facing forward. Okay, so we heard how that sounds just with one. Now I'm going to turn the second one on. Power on. Bluetooth mode. To connect the second one, I'm gonna press the Z. This is without reading the manual. I think they paired together. As you can see, it says orange and blue. So let's press play. Now both of them are playing. It's time to give you my conclusion about these speakers. They're definitely gonna be loud enough to use at a party, but they're not gonna have a lot of bass. So you can use it in that sense with this lanyard being a stop point. But you will use it on side by side. Even though they're on their sides, it doesn't really sound like it makes a difference from this being on the table. It doesn't enhance the bass or make it sound like it's muffled. It's really clear. I like the sound effects when it's left channel, right channel. But obviously if you buy one by itself, it's gonna be loud enough. It's not gonna have a lot of bass. Don't expect that out of the speaker. It looks cool. Um, it does connect very easy by just having these 
press buttons together and it will sync together. There is no delay between both of them. To turn up the volume, you have to press and hold. It does take a little bit to turn up. You can also answer and make calls through here, and that's the power, of course, and your little LED indicator for how much battery you have. And it doesn't end there. You do have the back of it. Remember, this is the back and then you can see that you have a micro SD card, the audio jack, and the charging port is in there. So it's kind of covered, so you can have some water, make it a little bit obvious that there's splashes going around it. If you're gonna take this out in the rain or by the pool, you got that aspect covered as well. But as always, I try to showcase the best I can. Obviously, you can't hear it through my microphone the best as it would be in your own ears. Now, how I can give you a rating on these, on its size, I would have to say, for its size, it's definitely around a seven out of 10. 10 for loudness. For bass, I would probably put it at 4 out of 10. Again, that is just my judgment comparing to all the other speakers that I have personally reviewed. I'm always going to be reviewing speakers, so you're always going to have a lot of variety on my channel to look for, but pretty much you're just going to have to settle for which kind of design and sound you want out of it. But for the last thing I'm going to do is connect it to the different mode. I'm going to select on this. FM radio mode. Can you hear it? Can you feel it? Power off. And that's it. Ultimately, it still comes out to what type of use you want out of it. Alrighty, thank you for watching. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Later.